and welcome back to my model railway room. Um, now, if I release the videos in the right order, you'll have seen that I got a very cheap Marklin three rail set, something I've never had before. And that has given me the unique opportunity to test something that I ordered by accident. <laughs> See, I, I always wanted an ICE 3. I think they're very nice looking sets. So I found one on Amazon by Pico. Sorry about that, got a phone call. Um, can't remember where I was up to, but I can't be bothered going over all of it again. Um, so yeah, I love the look of the Ice 3s, um, always wanted one. Um, so I found uh, a Pico one on Amazon, which was a really great price, and I thought, right, I'll have that. It arrives, and it's three rail, so I've not been able to run it, it's just sat in my cupboard for the past six months. But now, I can actually test it, and I'm really excited. I don't know what I'm going to do with it afterwards, if I'm going to keep it, or if I'm going to sell it on and use the funds toward the two rail version, which I might do. But, let's have a look. I mean, obviously, we got the the package there. This is just the, um, the set, it's not the complete starter set, so there's no controller, no track. It's just the, the train pack. So you've got you got your power car with a pantograph on. You've got your bistro, which is the restaurant car. Um, and you've got the two driving cars there. A great feature about these in real life is if you sit in this front portion here, there's like a glass partition between you and the driver, and you can actually see what the driver's doing. I think that's brilliant. Next time I get to Germany, we'll do that. But yeah, let's get it out of the box. Okay. So on top you've got your clear plastic protective cover. Let's just open that. And obviously the inner packaging is that sturdy polystyrene they use for everything, which protects it incredibly well. They also have the um, the inner sheath, which uh, stops any scratches while inside the box. Now this version is the, the one that was sold to Holland, the Netherlands. So it's got the insignia of the, um, is it the Netherlands spore wagon? Still in the standard ice colour scheme. And look at that, you get a little driver in there. That's good. Didn't expect that. So this is one of the power collecting driving trailers, but unmotorised. What they do is they simply collect power from the three rails and with the electric clip at the back, transfer it to the actual power car. So we'll pop that down. Take a quick look at the power car. Now that seems very light. I don't think that is the power car. Nice roof detail on there. Check the pantograph when it's sat on the track. Pop you in there for a second. Ah, there we go. That is very heavy. Ooh, a lot of weight in that. That's definitely going to shift. Looking at the connectors, there's a male and a female. So you can obviously only attach it in one order. So I'm going to get the, the four items out of the box. 
pop them on the track and connect them up. Now the the connecting clips between the carriages there are one, two, three, four, five little prongs that I'm guessing will be damaged quite easily. So we're going to be very careful. Give them both a little nudge. Little locating sliders on either side of the coupling. I'm guessing when they're aligned, it just pops together like that. Right, and I'll do that on the others. One thing I haven't mentioned yet is inside the box you do get all the usual Pico gump. We get a, a small catalogue outlining some basics of the range. You get the instructions, uh, warranty, um, safety things. Same thing you get in all the packs. So here we are all connected let's have a little play okay that's a bit noisy that is very noisy okay movement at about third power that should be better when it's running Directional lights, so that's nice. So yeah, smooth runner, a bit noisy, but I imagine that'll go down when it's running. Um, very disappointed it's three rail and I'm not going to keep it, because it would be very nice. But like I say, I'll use the funds from this to get a two rail one. Um, and then I'll buy the, the intermediate carriages as well to make it up to a full seven car unit. I think the seven car, or the eight car, one of the two. I'm sure it'll tell me on the box. But yeah, very nice, very nicely made. Um, again, like all Pico products, very crisp um, decals on the side. Uh, very accurate to the original, it's brilliant. Very impressed with that. Gutted. <laughs> See you later, bye.